Thunder bombs. West still has thunder bombs. There's a frog riding a car. There's a frog in a car. What is he doing? He's just driving around town? Welcome gamers to Super Beard Bowl Season 2. Each month, we're doing an all new 8 episode series complete with a beginning and an end as voted on by you, our loyal viewers. Without paying a single penny, everyone who watches will be able to vote on one of four show ideas and once you narrow it down from four to two, the Beard Bowl Patreon tier will then choose between the top two for which show gets made into a full eight episode series. This month, the winning series is PS Enter the Void, where the bros buy and play games they've never heard of before on the Sony PSN store with a budget that gets smaller every episode. The next public vote begins Monday, September 14th. So until then, just sit back, relax, and enjoy another incredible episode of Super Beard Bowl. Hey everyone! Y'all ready to see Welcome some to shitty games? Welcome to the Squeakwool. Shit. Am I right? The Squeakwool, dude. The PSN Squeakwool. You guys, let uh, you guys voted on this. We did this a while ago, and this is how we found the wonderful Animal Fight Club. Mm -hmm. We are doing this again. We are right now on the PSN store trying to find a game that we've never heard of, and our current price point, boys, is. Seven ninety nine or eight dollars. So here we are. In case you don't know the rules, here's how it works: eight episodes of this series where we go into the PSN store to look for games that we've never played, mm -hmm. and uh, we uh, every episode we have a decreasing price. So this episode we have eight dollars to work with. Next episode is seven, then six, so on and so forth. Uh, and we are looking for uh, a game that like none of us really know, and that looks like it might be the best thing we can get for that price. Yeah, and it can't be on sale. Yeah, can't so if it's seven dollars, but it's normally like fifteen, that's a no go. Yeah, um, can't be on. It can't be on sale. It can't be a game from a third or first published party, and it also can't be a VR game because oh yeah, that's I mean we, yeah, we that's just the technical do, limitation. We VR. Right, and uh, so. we only have five minutes to select the game, and that starts basically right now. So here we go. All right, we're gonna ignore all these arcade archives because these are all. I didn't know games. we had the stipulation of it can't be a, what did you say, a first or third person? Well, I mean, if you want to play Kangaroo or Mag Max or something, I'm fine. But, like, I don't want to do, like, Contra. Right. Sure, yeah, but, it, like, we're very familiar with Contra, which I feel like would take that okay, off the table but anyway. Buff Knight Advanced. Where's that? <laughs> Go down. Ooh, boy. Buff Knight Advanced. Oh, yeah. What is it? We only get one trailer per? Everybody gets Everybody gets one trailer. <laughs> Per episode? Is that real? Yeah. I thought it was one trailer pick per... All right, never mind. Damn. Yeah, it's, it's one trailer pick for each of us. So there's we get three trailer picks. Damn, okay. All right. So, Alex, you want to you want to look at Buff Night Advanced? Yeah, I don't know that I want to watch the trailer, I guess, but I, I don't know. There's not really a way to do it without watching the trailer. Four stars. Oh, wow. Adva a 2D uh, pixel it, RPG where you're constantly on the move. No screenshots. None? No, no, no screenshots and no trailer. Oh, there's a trailer. Do you want the trailer? No, 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 no. Back it out. I wish I could see the screenshots. Uh, let's see here. Dark Mystery, Devious Dungeon. I feel like some of these we saw in the Switch shop. I mean, probably, yeah. Oh, shit, Ellen. She's got her own game. Type. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't oh. know Five's Afraid is on PS4. Dude, Hell all no. Of them, dude. Yeah, get out of here, five minutes. I'm out. Bye bye. Gladiator Blades of Fury. Ghoul Boy. <laughs> <laughs> it's on sale. Oh, but it's, it's normally eight, so that kind of counts. Yeah. Ghoul Boy. Dark, Dark Sword, Sword of, of the Goblin. Or Goblin. You press up. And then press up again. And then go to the right. Go up again. And you can see nah, screenshots. That's, that's a negatory. There we, wait, there we go. Okay, yeah, see. I see you, Ghoul Boy. This okay. actually looks pretty sick, to be honest. It looks like a PC game from, like, 1991. I'm down with this. I'm down with yeah. Ghoul Boy. Ghoul Boy looks fun. 
Look, at, look at the zombie. <laughs> we'll bank it. Ghoul Boy's a good yeah. one. Yeah. Grow home. Habroxia. Habroxia. Oh man, I had Habroxia, but then I had some penicillin. I'm good to go. <laughs> Press up and then up again. Yeah, there you go. It's like a All right. Metroidvania shmup. I love these types of games, so I, I would this I'm I Is it a Metroidvania? Why do you think it's a Metroidvania? Did it say that? It 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 doesn't, but it says horizontal and vertical, and I'm like wondering if you have freedom of movement or if it's just a scroller. Blast your way through a myriad of extraterrestrial and in scrolling shooter. Arc- okay. Yeah. Fifteen levels featuring intense boss fights, rescue missions, shifting perspectives, and untold surprises. All right. Great. Hyper Sentinel. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's Io? Besides one of the moons of Jupiter? Jupiter? Saturn? Jupiter? I don't remember. Physics platformer in which you control a ball. By uh. growing and shrinking the ball, you can influence its speed and weight. Whoa. Okay. Hey, there he is. Oh, wait a minute, yo. Oh, oh. Uh. Oh, oh. Hey, that's kind of cool. Okay. Oh. I thought it was going to be 3D, but it not, it's not 3D. Mm-mm. Okay. Cool. See, but here's the thing. I can already see. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's kind of badass. It's like a physics game. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Legend of the Skyfish. Let them come. Just a, just a phrase. That's that's like a party game, I'm sure. Wing. Mm. Lost Wing. That looks sweet. <clears throat> we ain't got much time. Ki- Miles and Kilo. Sonic and Tails. <laughs> Max and the Book of Chaos. Max. Necrosphere Deluxe. Yeah, we ain't got Nightstrom. much time, baby. Yeah, we got all right, we gotta make a call here. Well, it sounds like the three of us already found one that we like each individually. We have Io, Habroxia, and Ghoul Boy. Well, you're the, the one deal. playing, yeah, You're the one playing, so you you make the call. No, it's a vote. We voted last time. We vote again. Well, I don't remember voting. And sh- I I'm think happy. you should make the call. I'm happy with Ghoul Boy. I'm happy with any of these. Yeah, they're, uh, they're fine. All right, why don't we start with Ghoul Boy? All right. Ghoul Boy. All right, we'll see you guys after this bad boy's downloaded. Yeah, um, while this is getting downloaded, why don't you put a Ted. picture of yourself showing off your favorite DVD in your collection? This is for Megan or for or Megan Ted. or for Ted, whoever does this. Welcome back. It's Ghoul Boy time. <laughs> That's Dolores zombie. Dolores Entertainment. Dolores. Oh, Red oh, Row. Yeah, Red Row. Oh my God, this looks so, so Red Row, dude. Guns of Guns Bar. Guns of Bar. <laughs> There's a gloomy <laughs> land where witches, ghouls, and lots of spooky monsters live in. I like couldn't be Don't. proud of my homeland if it was called Guns of Bar. <laughs> it was ruled by a Don't cool end your sentence in a preposition. King, Gam- Gammon Ball, but there are Gammon pro- Ball. There were a prophecy made among sorcerers, but according here. to this prophecy, the last Goblin King was going to be murdered by a ghoul hunter. The Goblin Do King knew that. Do we care about this? Uh, he, he was Goldar, Goldar came. A, a merciless berserker. Goldar had a son, foolery kid named Tholgar. So like his dad, Tholgar's oh, fame started to be heard from He's so much lands. cuter than everyone on People the planet. People called him Ghoul Boy. Before long, Gimmaball had tracked Goldar. Okay, um, so the okay, son, great. so the son has to go save the dad, and the son looks like Astro Boy. Actually, you know who he looks like? Hermie the elf from uh, Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. Mm, 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 the hair, yeah. Why am I such a nitwit? So the bad guy in that cutscene, quote unquote cutscene, he just looked like Skeletor before he died. Yeah, I, I don't think they're trying to go for freshness with the setting here. So oh, what do we man, got? He's... Castlevania vibes. Looks like it. Oh, how are you supposed to make that? Oh my god. god. Damn. What a fucked up amount of health to take. Like 75. Yeah, fuck that's you. It's like, you may as well just make it half, homie. You might like, as well just on. kill me. Yeah. Okay. Damn. Oh. What? C- can you not make the jump at all? Dude. Is this just oh. like prank game? Like you buy it and then you can't make the first jump? 
That would be Guys, legitimately I funny. I swear Wait. I'm not. <clears throat> Weapons. Uh huh. Okay. I have a double oh, jump. Yeah. You have a double jump. Oh, perfect. Okay. Dude, he does not like that water. Sick. Oh, I like Volgar. Okay. Yeah. You know, Tholgar. Volgar the Viking. <laughs> no, no, Alex, we are Tholgar. Oh, Tholgar. <laughs> Tholgar the child Viking. Oh, the Manitar. Dude, that guy looked like he was about to just cut your body off. He was about to shank a child with no remorse. Dude, the, the frame of that guy getting hit looked like he was like a secret about his life was revealed. You know what's driving me crazy is that the sound effects and the sound chimes are large are, are louder than the music. Huh. How does it feel? Not great. Why? Uh, it's just not very, um... I don't oh. know how to describe it. It doesn't feel very, uh, precise. Like, I'm attacking you know what? there's a bit of- Oh my god! Is that him? You are injured. <laughs> Yeah, I got talked by skeleton zombies. I'm gonna last long. Take this sword and it'll be your beck and call. Oh, sick, sick. All right. Nice. So yeah, when you say like, what do you mean? Like, is there like a delay between when you press a button and shit comes out? Like, what's going on? Yeah. It looks There's floaty to me too. Looks like you have plenty of control in the air though. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, the double jump feels good. Yeah, I'm down with this. This is cute. I think we might have picked a good one. This is the most gamey of all the games that we've ever played on this, this show. <laughs> all right. Level complete. Level complete. Are those quotation marks like in Viking, they go in the bottom, kind of like Spanish? <laughs> Upside down question mark. Right. <gasps> Yo, that thing dipped. I am the Manitar. I wear loincloth. I'm a cow, but I am blue. I am related to Babe. <laughs> Woo! Oh, that late? Oh my god. Getting confident with that double jump. You love <laughs> to see it. with my fucking soul here. I have to. You Why? love to see it, to be honest. <laughs> to be entertaining? Oh, I, no, it was just, it was just, a, it felt difficult. Like, I had to, I had to... Oh, uh, okay. Because I thought you were like, check this shit out. Because that's the way I'd play the motherfucker. You remember, I just like fucking with people. Sneak rits. Sneaky. I wonder what the money's for. Microtransactions. Yeah. I don't know, man. It costs $250 to play a level. <laughs> okay. That's the one thing I really don't want to run into. That's like the thing that sucks the most about all the games on the Switch eShop. Mm. Is like all the shit that's like a cell phone game that became uh. a Switch game. Right. We this like, feels like a full-fledged game, though. Yeah, this feels like a proper game. <gasps> oh! The sprites are really cool, too. Uh, wow, ask and, asked and answered. Yeah. Plus ten? Okay. It's just I replenishing, I see. Okay. Later, man. So oh. far, so... Oh my god, the recovery! Oh, Gerard! Look at that. Oh. That, that box. Did you kill one of them by pushing the box onto it? No, I like gave myself iframes. <laughs> <laughs> by like having the box be in between us. What is the fireball that he keeps dropping? Is that like another power up that you have? Which one? It looks yeah. like the ma the, min the Manotar keeps dropping like a fireball power up. Maybe not. I think that's just him exploding, bro. Yeah. It's just in a box. Maybe. Yeah, I'm not seeing that. Oh. Now, let's see this guy. See that? No, it literally just looks like explosions. Looks like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles NES, like, power-up drop. What the fuck? Are you s what? Dude, is your spider sense tingling? Yo! <laughs> Incredible. Dude, the completionist, look at that. He gripped his toes on that thing. He legit found a secret, too. <laughs> Some apple. Boom. 
retro off. Oh, oh. that's fun. Oh, sick. Dude, this yeah. is cool. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I know people like purists are kind of like down on filters, but I feel like they're so much oh, better than they man. used to be. Oh, did you reload checkpoint? I hit restart <laughs> when I was trying to reset the... <laughs> I think I just... I don't yeah. think you're that far back. Nah, nah, yeah, you're not that bad. The level was so good, you want to do it again, right? It's like a I Sonic level. So. It's got so many different paths. Look, this looks sick. This is not like a groundbreaking game by any means, but like shout outs to the art, shout outs to the idea of doing a game like this in 2020. I'm hype on it. Mm. I mean, the release, I date, like the release date for this game was three years ago, so it's, it's a bit on the older side. Little did they I know. I feel like this is something that uh, the kids from Stranger Things, like if we saw them playing a video game and then we like, they cut to the screen, it would be this. Yeah, exactly. It has that, it has that PC vibe. Like, big time. Except his hair is too well animated. His hair is incredible. It's luscious. Man, you're I'm getting close. I'm the prettiest Viking boy! Oh, checkpoint. Nice. Shrek point. Shrek boy. Nice. That was completely worth it. I like the little, uh, scrolling effect on the background. You love to see it. And they can't- oh, they can get you. They, they just, just walk, walk right past it. They're like, hello, yeah, it's still 3D. They don't give a shit. <laughs> I love the pause the Minotaur has when he's like, oh! Is that a fucking child? He's like, oh. this is how I die. <laughs> so far, so good, man. Like, if they can all be at least this good on this series, like, we're cruising. I'm having a good time watching this. I, ho I, want, I, I hope there's a boss. Yeah, that'd be nice. I hope we can get there in time. I also hope that I have some nice food to eat later. Oh, man, dude. I did a good job today on the food front. Yeah, what'd you have? I had just really good bacon that I made. I mm. found it in my fridge. It was not expired, so I made it, and it was just perfectly cooked with a baguette that I had left over. <laughs> a baguette? Boinguette. Alex, let me borrow $150. Okay. For sushi. You got it. Thank you, sir. If that's the kind of patron like that I can be to people, so be it. I mean, you did say borrow, so you're going to return it, right? Oh, fuck. You're right. If somebody's like, I really want to do this, but I just can't. I'll pay you back later. I'd be like, that's wimpy. We're describing wimpy. Yeah, but like wimpy, you know, he's not into the he's not into the sushi. Wimpy's. Yeah, he would never do that. Actually, I don't know if he ever had like. The opportunity to have that? Do you, do you think Wimpy would be down for that? If he Who can do get you think Wimpy would vote for? Today? Yeah. Whoever can, like, assure him the most hamburgers? He just has the- he's like a single issue voter. Yeah, so Trump, I guess. I, yeah, I feel see, like that's what I'm saying. Yeah, because Trump would look at that guy and be like, he's like, oh, I see you like hamburgers. I, I can assure you I'll give you the most hamburgers. Wimpy, like, fucking done, dude. Fucking I done. I invented the hamburger. Right, and Wimpy would be all about it. Um... Did you just, like, pipe warp this level? Fuck this level, apparently. Uh-oh. Jerron! So bold. <laughs> Yo, the death sound is cool, though? Yeah, that was badass. What the f- This is the new checkpoint, though, right? Yeah. I want to go on record and say that Gerard made the coolest choice he could have made. Just leaping into the void? Yeah. Yes! Dude, it's so on theme with the show, too. P.S. Enter the Void? Come on. Right. Uh, I, I hope Enter the Void is an actual phrase, because if not, I named this after a movie that is about somebody slowly dying while they OD on drugs oh. from the first person. I, I thought there'd be treasure up there. Instead, I just found a gigantic shortcut. Death I think, was like, the treasure. I think, like, it was a good call for, like, speedrunning the level, but... 
for I think speed maybe running. that for, you were supposed to jump purposes, on that. For speedrunning purposes. Yeah, I think you're supposed to jump on that little guy. Dude, my hitbox range is huge. Yeah, Anyone when they said big sword, they weren't fucking around. They were not. What do you think those things are called? Uh, Skullskeetos? Skullskeetos? Yeah. Like a Skulltella? 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 Right. Skulltella? What do we think? Skulltella, come on. See if that makes sense. Skulltella. Skull but you think that- I feel like it's missing some... Uh, syllables. <laughs> Cause you want that ranch, you know what I mean? It should be like skeleton. Skeletonchilla. Skelantula? Is that what you want? Yeah, Skelantula. Hmm. Okay. I need to save him from Lord Gumball. <laughs> Look at you. Nice. The dude took oh. a- What were you saying, Jarrett? The guy just like took the sword like it did nothing to him. Like he blocked the oh. sword going through his stomach and was like, ooh. Oof. <laughs> ooh, oh, that sh Wait a minute. Spear what does that switch to? I hit it. Probably does something upstairs. Probably. You want that treasure, though, don't you? Let's see if you can make it happen. Of course you okay. can. Oh, no. He's the goblin boy. This is the game over, though, now. Nah, you no. can make Ooh, this. Woo! Woo! Oh, my God. Okay. Here we go. This Look is the camera, good stuff. Camera zoomed out for a second, like, you're gonna need this. Oh. How about skull fly? Nailed it. Head bug. Nailed it. Head bug? Head beetle. Bu bug, <laughs> bug head. Bug, bug bugs, head. Bug, bug. Bug head. Bug bug. Woo! Skull gun <laughs> fly. Here we go. Here we go. The skull is going to fly. Alright. So that's like the third level. Are they just gonna throw you back in another one? Yeah, they're just like... Is there going. bosses? <laughs> How many levels are there? 300? Yeah, I would love like some sense of progression, like an idea of like... It's a picture. Right. Like, you know... I think Mario oh Brothers... Oh, had a, oh, what the? oh! Not a background in, uh, element. I think Mario Brothers had a really like smart thing when they were like World One One. You know what I mean? Yes. Gives you an idea of like what you're in for. Uh, Agreed. But this game is fucking cool. I mean, but I'm not playing it. Uh, we're gonna wrap it up now. Oh. oh. Wait. What happens if you press yes? Whatever. Just back to the beginning of the stage. <laughs> is this the, I, the, the fourth I, I stage? I do lose all my items though, so I don't have any of my. Oh. But you can't game over, huh? I guess infinite lives, I guess. Okay. Wow, so much easier what's, that time. What's the name of this game? <laughs> Ghoul Boy. <laughs> right. Hey, Ghoul Boy is cool by me, but once again, I am not playing it. Drug. You can tell because he has horns. Ah, right. Um, it's okay. It it it's not bad. It's it's not a hundred percent there. Um, it it kind of harkens a little bit to the. You know, to a flash game. Um, hmm. It seems to be yeah, combining. I see that. It it's got like be game maker vibes. Yeah, it, it's combining a lot of elements from several different indie games, like Thousand and One Spikes, uh, Shovel Knight. That's literally um, the asset, I think. Yeah, literally, that's that might be straight from Thousand and One Spikes. Um, uh, fucking Volgar the Viking, like I think is the big one with the mechanic of um, throwing Sticking a spear. In the wall. Yeah, I think that's a that's a huge indicator of of its inspiration. Whether that's true or not, I I don't know. I could be wrong. Um, but yeah, it definitely a game that had a lot of potential, uh, but just kind of comes off as a quick, easy purchase for uh, you know an indie company. No disrespect by any means, but uh, definitely not as polished as some of the games that are probably available on PSN. Yeah, I feel that. <laughs> All right, this has been Ghoul Boy, and it's probably just gonna get worse from here. Thanks for watching, everybody. Yeah, I'm yeah. pretty. I'm pretty optimistic that this is like the quote unquote worst one. You know, this is a good vibe. You, you think we're gonna just find a bunch of great games this time? Uh, I, I'm kind of hope. I'm kind of hoping for another Animal Fight Club. 
Dude, if they have Animal Fight Club, the literal game on here, let's just play it. <laughs> yeah, we'll just play that. Let's play it yeah. again. Play it again. The general, the general bites, dude. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Next time on PS Enter the Void, seven dollars. We'll, we'll see you guys soon. Peace out. Bye. Bye. Oh! You won't the way these sex no more. Why can he sex? Kill that man. No. Why not? You I can just take an elevator. Why can he sex? He used to be wackity sex. Why can he sex? Why can he sex? Why can he sex? Why can he sex?